the Senate is supposed to be above the fray of U.S. politics. It's always been seen as the higher chamber, the adults in the room. It's now a Breitbart disinformation echo chamber on the Republican side, clearly. And so unless we dismantle all these systems that allow disinformation to flourish, how are we going to have unity as a country? How are we going to have a successful rollout of a vaccine when all these people can be driven mad into thinking this vaccine is a government conspiracy to insert microchips inside of them? So what we're telling you is that, yes, it's a huge relief that Biden is president, but what you're going to see as he comes to power and as he starts making adult decisions and as he starts rolling out this vaccine that we need to take in order to save lives, save our healthcare workers, reopen schools, bring our economy back, you're going to see a rabid backlash against all of that. And you're going to see it driven by Trump and the cultish army that he has created. And it's not going to end until Facebook is broken up. It's not going to end until Mark Zuckerberg is removed from power somehow and Facebook finally does the right thing or it's forced to break up. It's not going to end until we have laws in place against the harmful, life-destroying virus of disinformation.